We are an automotive research company that's come up with a piston deactivation engine with variable compression ratio, which we think is a, well we know, is a world first. So explain more about that product then and what makes it special. Okay, well what makes it special, first of all, is that an auto-cycle standard car engine is about 10% efficient at low load points. It's perhaps 35% efficient at high load points. Now, most car engines run at very low load conditions, either around town or out on the highway. So if you can run an engine at a higher load point, in other words, make that engine suit the size of the load, reduce the size of the engine in real time to suit the conditions, then you can get the best of both worlds. And that's what this engine achieves, because by disabling pistons on demand through the engine management system, which happens in about 40 milliseconds, you can adjust the size of the engine to the load. This means that the engine can run at that 35% efficiency point much more often through the European driving cycle than um, it otherwise would, not at the 10% end. And that's where the major fuel saving is. About 30% from a standard engine. But as well as that, we can adjust the uh, compression ratio in this engine which is particularly uh, handy in applications where uh, you have a turbo, but without a turbo it also is very handy. So these two technologies together, in one engine, the one simple mechanism, it's a variant of a standard car engine, there's not a great variant, just the bottom end, all the top end stays exactly the same, we can achieve between 30 and 40 percent fuel reduction. Those are impressive numbers, you say you're pretty sure it's a, a well first, what's the reaction been? Well, we've had a lot of interest. Uh, we've only just uh, registered um, the last patent, and so we haven't had much publicity yet because we haven't been able to go forward with too much right now. We've had a website up for a couple of months now, but we've had terrific reactions so far, a lot of interest. People think that it's a very simple mechanism that holds a lot of promise, and we're hoping that uh, something will come of that for us. And you must have had some interesting conversations here at the show. We have. We've had a lot of interesting conversations. Uh, we have some meetings with... Uh, people that we're very pleased to be able to meet with uh, coming up. Uh, so um, yes, people have been very surprised and uh, really it's an engine that is a, it's a break, I believe truly it's a breakthrough engine, so it's caught people's interest. And why was it important for Scalzo to come to this event in particular? Well it is an engine technology show and we thought that that was the right place to go. Europe um, is an area where downsizing and turboing up is a strategy that's used a lot. This engine is particularly uh, useful in that, uh, in that way. Um, so we thought uh, we'll chance our hand, come over here and uh, see if we can just generate a bit of interest. It's proved a good decision? It has. We're very pleased and uh, very optimistic and looking forward to uh, the next uh, few months.